You know, nine years isn't a long time, but that small amount of time is all three families got to spend their chill with their children before a shooter gunned them down on what was supposed to be a regular day at school. Good evening, everyone. I'm Bob Mueller. And I'm Haley Wilgus. Thanks for joining us here on News 2 at 4. We're learning more about who that shooter was and why they went back to their old school and murdered six innocent people. The police chief revealed disturbing details today about the shooter. There is still no motive, but we did learn Audrey Hale had about seven guns from five different local gun stores. Hale hid the guns from their parents, but they were all bought legally. Chief John Drake says Hale used three of those guns yesterday. Drake says Hale's parents were worried and felt Hale should not own guns. As far as the manifesto goes, we heard about that yesterday. Chief Drake said Covenant wasn't the only school mentioned. So in the manifesto, there's several different writings about other locations. Uh, there were locations, of, uh, there was uh, talks about um, the school, there was a map of the school, a drawing of how uh, potentially she would enter and the assaults that would take place. Uh, there's a, it's quite a bit of uh, writing to it. I have not read the whole, the entire manifesto. Our team and the FBI has been working uh, on this. Now, we also learned Hale was under a doctor's care for an emotional disorder, but the chief did not elaborate any further on that. 